There was once a poet who fell upon such hard times that he was no longer able to feed his family. So he decided to set out for the palace and appeal to the generosity of the king. Upon being asked by the king, he starts reciting his poems. Wow, 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 wow. The king, well pleased, asked him to name his reward. Pointing to the finely wrought chessboard, the poet said, Your Highness, if you place just one grain of rice in the first square, and double it for every square, I will consider myself well rewarded. Are you sure? Mm, just grains of rice and not gold? Yes, your highness. So it shall be. So the courtiers started placing the grains of rice. One on the first square. Two on the second square. Four on the third square. 8 on the 4th square and so on. By the time they came to the 10th square, they had to place 512 grains of rice. By the time they came to the 20th square, the number swelled to 5,24,288. When they came to the halfway mark, the 32nd square, the grain count was 214 crores, 74 lakhs, 83,648 bullock cart loads of grain. Soon the count increased to lakhs of crores. Eventually, the hapless king handed over his entire kingdom to the clever poet. And it all began with one grain of rice. Moral of the story Never underestimate the power of compounding. If you systematically invest a small sum every month, your SIP can grow to a very impressive sum when you retire. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risks. Please read the statement of additional information and the scheme information document carefully before investing.